Well, I don't think I've ever met someone that doesn't love Italian food. Maybe they don't necessarily love the calories and carbs that come along with it. So uh, Chef Ray has a perfect solution for you this morning. He's with Cafe Pasta and you're going to talk about some healthier options when it comes to pasta. And that just sounds like a win win for everybody. Well, and I have to tell you how we came up with this concept. I was walking into Fidelity Bank and a banker Heather Cross said, I'm on a keto diet. Can you come up with some? So that's how we came up with our brand new keto menu that we're starting today and which has plenty of keto items and low car items in which right now we're going to show you how we're going to do our mac and cheese with the he, as you see he's already boiled off the cauliflower and broke it up and he's going to add his cream and and ours we're going to use this time you use cheddar mozzarella white cheddar and the parmesan and then our fresh herb seasonings. And there, that's really all there is to it. And of course, if you want to be really fun, you got to do your bacon on top. It's nothing like a little good bacon. Oh yeah. Because again, it, I mean, the great thing about the keto is 75% of it's healthy fat, 20% of it's protein, clean proteins, and 5% carbs. And then you get into your ketones and you're burning calories and looking good. Oh yeah, I know keto is kind of the fad diet right now. A lot of people, actually some of my friends do that. So I know that they would be happy to hear about this. Now, when it comes to this cauliflower, how do you get started with it? Did you say that you, you break it apart first? You, you boil it and boil okay. it, for, you know, it, 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 to whatever you like. You know, usually it's about five to 10 minutes. And after you break it apart, then you add your herbs and your cream and your cheese. But the, the great thing about a lot of these, uh, as you showed in the last segment, we have the zucchini boats. You can do a lot of the same uh, menu items that we have. And we also do, instead of having pasta, we do spaghetti squash. Or we can take a zucchini and turn it into linguine and make our sauces from there, whether it's using fresh herbs, uh, fresh olive oil. And again, you're at the keto level and, of course, low carb. Yeah. So please tell me, okay, so I feel like some people might be like, oh, how, like, how would you substitute pasta with veggies? Like, does that even taste good? From personal experience, I can say so, but I'm going to let you explain it to them. Well, again, that's how we came up with the spaghetti squash. People still like that uh, al dente uh, texture to it. And once you switch to it, a lot of our good customers uh, continue on with spaghetti squash. So you're constantly eating vegetables with a light sauce and you're still eating healthy. I mean, yeah, you can't complain about that. Okay, so how long does this mac and cheese take to cook? I mean, you can do this whole menu probably in about 15 minutes. Oh, so super and easy. That'd be great to have for lunch today. Oh, definitely, definitely. And I, uh, of course, uh, I have to give a shout out to Ed and, uh, <laughs> and, and for the true inspiration here, uh, this is my mom's birthday and she's our real Aww. boss. And so we have to wish her a happy birthday and, and keeping us up on our toes and keep changing our menus to make everybody happy. Yeah, well, happy birthday to your mom. We hope that you have a wonderful birthday. Ed br brought her some sunshine too for her birthday so we can thank him for Great. that. And that keto we menu, really appreciate it. the keto menu starts today, right? Yes, uh, we did it on your show. Well, we are so excited for that. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Well, thank you guys. All right. We will see you all later. And we're going to have these recipes actually posted on our website, WFMYNews2.com.